Alrighty guys, so welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode, where today we are starting Episode 7. Now, I will give you guys a little heads up. Um, I did accidentally hit play on this. Technically, I forgot to start recording and I started this. Luckily, I caught myself before we got too far in. So yeah, now we're restarting. But I do have a little bit of a problem. Unfortunately, we, unfortunately, we can't see the recap. We just start off at the very beginning of the episode, so just no recap though. But yeah, anyways, uh, we're gonna hop right into this. And again, sorry on uh, no video yesterday. Uh, it was my birthday, and I wanted to not have to record anything. So yeah, anyways, let's go. Wow, that, that's a lot of stairs. And all revealed by the redstone heart. Amazing. Yeah, not bad, right? Okay, uh, let's get the redstone heart here. Again, I'm sad. We get, we have to miss the recap and that actually like you. perfectly leads into what we're about to do. All right, time to go home. Yes, please. I can't believe we're finally this close. Ah, <sighs> feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree with some of the aesthetic choices. Oh, you just love being mysterious, don't you? Is that like your favorite thing? What? I don't know what you're talking about. I just try not to think about this place very often. Kind of thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. I guess you could say that. Oh, come on, Harper. Going home is fun. You should be excited. <laughs> Clearly, you've never met the others before. Others? You mean we're going to meet more old builders? Still don't like it when you call us that. Yep, but I gotta warn you. They're not as friendly as I am. I'm probably the, uh, nicest old builder. Uh-huh. Old builder social politics. My goodness. Yikes. If you're the nicest old builder, these other ones must be really terrible. Hey, too mean. I'm trying to help here, all right? Well, you're going to give us the Atlas, and then we can go home, right? Kind of. The Atlas isn't exactly mine to give. It belongs to the other, uh, old builders. And, well, they might not want to give it up. Oh, now you tell us. Why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? Good instincts? Harper, I thought that's why we brought you. To convince them to hand over the Atlas. You're not going to let us down, right? I'm going to do my best, but I warn you now that there could be complications. What kind of complications? You'll see when you get there. Jesse, come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. They haven't exactly been great, remember? No, I think she's definitely hiding something. But if we're going to get home, we need her help. Agreed. Don't oh, worry. Oh, sorry if I'm also extremely quiet. I've home. never seen this episode, and I'm kind of just watching it as Jesse. I play. Sorry. I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise you both, I am trying to help. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. Okay. Ah, very what? This was about when I realized there, last time I wasn't recording. So. What? Yep, I am still recording. Okay. Good. Checked. I had to double check. Come on now. What is this? Go. Go. I can like We can't move it. Do we have here? Seems as if some new competitors have entered the match. My, isn't that special? I just, what in the world did Harper dump us into? Like some sort of crazy game. Really? You think this is a no, game? No, no. Jesse's right. Spleef. Gesundheit? No, it's a game. You try to knock the floor out from other people and make them fall. Ah, be like this! <laughs> Get 
Get him. Oh, he's dead. Only decent teammates. They crushed him. Oops, did face me drop something? Oh, dodge, Lucas. Jesse, Jesse, let's help Petra. Get Ivor. We helped uh, Lucas last time. I think this is gonna help Petra more. I guess. Wow, nice one, Jesse. That was close. Ivor, Lucas. No, 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 no. Well, it can't be. Whoa, no way, dude. I got a double. <laughs> no! <coughs> hey, 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 whoa! This is a misunderstanding, dude. What are you doing? Hey! Using weapons is against the rules! Rules? Not cool, dude. So not cool. <laughs> slap is down. I repeat, slap is down. Stop the match! Not since the days of Tim have we seen such heated play. That's totally against the rules, right? Yeah, I didn't think we could throw TNT back at the gladiators. Nice one, brah. Who do you think you are? Whoa. Now, I and think... now you're just trying to be all buddy No one buddy? makes okay, sense. None of you are responding like you should be to what's going on, so are you all crazy? Mind controlled? What? Whoa. Hang on, dude. I am not in charge here, okay? It's them. Yes, we are the ones in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match. Ever. It definitely is strange, Mevia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately. This is going to require some reconfiguring of the stats, for sure. Okay, you're in charge. Awesome. Now, can you just explain what the heck is going on here? What's going on here is you just ruined our round of spleef. Attacking competitors? Horrid! And technically against the rules. Ugh, lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, I've got a game we could play. I'll go first. Okay, just tell me straight. What are these games that you keep talking about? I think if we all just calm down, I can explain. Your friends aren't dead. Wait, what? How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> that would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously, they come back and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <gasps> Your friends are alive and well. But I saw them die. How are they alive? Oh, I'm not surprised that you're confused. Tiny brains. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. <clears throat> in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, Sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. Spill! Oh, why bother? They all end up in the mines. We're from another world. Yeah? Well, you and everyone else here, Pipsqueak. You know what you are, champ? You're just a little gate crasher. And what do we do with gate crashers? Kill them and send them to the mines. Back off, muscles. Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, champ, why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? Oh, adorable. We came for the Atlas. I want you to hand it over so my friends and I can go home. Straight into the point. Well, I'd like it. 
If I weren't simmering with barely controlled rage right now. Hmm. We're, of course, not going to do any of those things, but admirable try. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything to someone like you? You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Because I have something you want. Oh? <laughs> you must be joking. I think we got to show him the heart. Oh, jokes! Ha <laughs> ha! Hilarious! Nope, not joking. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. I've got a couple things that might interest you. Oh, send them to the mines. Let's go what with the redstone this? heart. I present the redstone heart. Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off with that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Thing's no toy, slugger. How about you just hand it over, huh? It could be uh pretty dangerous if you don't know how to use it. <coughs> Harper. <laughs> Oh, I've got you interested now, don't I? You've certainly got my attention, yeah. Here's the way my offer works. You give me the heart, you and your friends go back down to those portals, I never look at your insignificant face again. Wait, without the Atlas? But how will we get home? So, not my problem. This is a one-time offer. Clearly things have been getting out of hand. Let's start over and see if we can reach an agreement. Okay. Okay, fine. I can always appreciate someone trying to be so reasonable. So I'm guessing Hadrian here is well, the ringleader of the old builders. You need the He's others. the one that's taken charge. And I need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, the Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me. Everyone enjoys these games. Can't wait to see what the other games are. I hope they're fun. Well, there you have it. A deal's been struck, huh? To the games! All right, then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, addendum. enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose, Harper has to go to the mines, too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. Oh no, I just realized my gain was messed up, so I hope you guys now realize that I'm talking better. I'm sorry, just noticed. Jesse, this was not part of the plan. <laughs> Wrapped up in one of Hadrian's <laughs> deals. Ugh! Sorry, He's did not mean to cough in the mic either. Hand, you know. Sort of hoped I had left all his negotiating behind me. Harper, how bad is this going to be? Give it to me straight. It's not going to be a cakewalk, that's for sure. Hadrian has people play the games now just for his own amusement. Yeah, he seemed like a real treat. Uh, I'm s I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. I am trying also to make up with Harper and not be rude to her because at the end of last episode, as you guys realized, I did kind of want to make the decision to patch things up with her and the people of that world. And we kind of just let the people of that world kick her out. We used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Ooh, we got polar bears. Well, here it is. The competitor village. Sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep. At least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Wow, that's just horrible. I know. Is it just me or does it seem like my shoulder pads on Jesse are glowing a bit? Mm. <laughs> they didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. 
And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm going to go confer with Otto. We go way back, and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait. We still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. Ugh. I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines. Which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Nuh-uh. No way. They do not get to put my friends in their stupid minds. Yeah, we gotta bust them out of there. Hadrian always was one for maximizing useful, uh, uh, productivity. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. Alrighty. If you believe in me, I believe in me. Our friends I guess. Quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. So, I'm guessing here... To actually like progress the story like and move on we would have to go talk to uh face meet here so let's go and start with like talking to the other teams we'll start with the yellow wow, team here you are that crazy person in extreme spleef decent not as good as tim but decent that's who's more tim? than i can say for most who's tim oh my gosh where do i start okay okay tim legendary tim the tim first off Tim is my hero. Here's the secret. We're all just trying to be like Tim. He's uh, perfect. But that you, okay, I'll who is Tim? Then. You didn't tell me who Tim is. Uh, it sounds Impressive. like that gal might be a little out of it. Block food dojo. Some sort of practice space. Looks like everyone's working hard. Oh, smells like it too. Alright, let's talk to this Nell. She's the gal that eliminated Ivor oh, and Lucas. You from Spleef. You were like amazing. I'm Nell. And I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your problems. My shoulder pads are glowing. Especially what the since hell? you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> It, um, well, it wasn't very chill. Speaking of my friends, have you seen them lately? Nope, sorry. They're, like, probably in the mines. And that's on me. Such bad karma. Bad karma. I will never do that to one of your friends again, because, man, I do not want to be on your bad side. I gotta say, you keep playing like that, and you'll be, like, Tim status. Maybe Tim, she can tell like me who Tim one, is. Like you could. Oh, she People is. People are like already talking about it. They're gonna like say stuff. Compare you to Tim. I'm not here to be a Tim. I just want to get home. But that's like exactly nobody's like what giving me a straight Tim answer. Status. Tim didn't want to be Tim either. He got his whole team home. Listen. Okay, I now I guess I somewhat. Bad about taking out your friend. I guess he's the I guy that you. won. So if you ever need. Anything, games? you just come and ask, shall? Okay, so she said if I ever need anything, come to her. I gotta remember that. Uh, hey. You are the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely She's be able rude. to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Then I guess we're even. Oh, no way we're even. You still have a good teammate left. And you still have all your fancy gear. I'm stuck with two blockheads now. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long, so you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Unless I win, which I will, you've got guts. I respect that. Just can't wait to see those guts on the arena floor. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. No, you don't understand. I have to win. Winning is the only way my friends and I can go home. 
Is that how it works? That's what we're all trying to do. Yeah. Yeah, well, she's not a nice person. Good luck with getting home. Uh, wood blocks. Wooden planks, solid. Okay. Don't know what I would need those for. Didn't give me the option to pick them up. Um, this is one of the gladiators that... Oh, this is the gladiator that hey, we threw the Lucas's TNT at. Journal. You say something tiny? Because I'm trying Did to read you say here. that's Lucas's journal? So if you don't mind... That book you're reading? Hand it over. It doesn't belong to you. <laughs> wow. Ooh, that was so scary. I almost fell over. Hey, wait a minute. You're the pipsqueak that knocked me out of my tower. Yeah. And this belonged to that little blonde buddy of yours. And you expect me to just hand it over? Because I'm actually enjoying myself. There are some fascinating and thrilling tales in here. Hey, don't get too steam. Maybe we can make a deal? And slab the immovable. Oh, we can make a deal. If you do everything I say, when I say it, and don't make me mad again, maybe I'll consider giving you this stupid book back. <sighs> Can't you see I'm trying to read? Jeez. Huh? Sorry. <sighs> okay, so, uh, guess we're done talking to him. That armor is pretty sweet. Not as sweet as mine, <laughs> of course. Can I go talk to you? Doesn't look like it. Anything over here? Purple team. Excuse me. Psh. Wow, rude. Okay. They're just rude. Clutch? Was that what her hey. name was? Get out of here before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <laughs> it's so nice when new contestants are in the village. It's lovely having fresh meat for us gladiators to destroy. Yeesh, why is everyone so cranky around here? Could be that we're forced into an endless cycle of destruction. Just a guess, though. Fine, I'm out of here. Okay, yeah, I don't think Bye -bye. we're going to get anything Can't productive to talking to her. Because it's literally giving me a, a back out option the whole time. Anything over here... Oh, shovel planet. Nice. Anything. Blue team. Wow, they look focused. They must really want to win this thing. Here lies, Here the, lies platform. the platform on which Tim stood to win these great games. Hope I'll be standing there soon. Something about this Tim just seems fishy, I ain't gonna lie. You a big fan of Tim? <laughs> oh, forget I asked. Petra? Hey, Jesse. Finding your way around all right? Yeah, starting to. Nice. You know, this place would actually be a blast if it weren't for the whole against their will thing. I mean, Spleef was awesome, but... Totally agree. The actual game was fun. It just stinks that all this has to be part of it. I just hope we can get home soon. I'm a little creeped out by the people that run this place. Let's keep trying to find Ivor and Lucas. Agreed. Okay, I think that's everyone except uh, Face Me. So let's go talk to him. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat. Wait a minute. You're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab. And face meat doesn't block cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat air. Face meat prefers dweeb free air. What do you know about the old builders who run this place? Well, one, they hate being called old builders. Two, they're face meat's bosses. Three, they're not big on hugs. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines. Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on face meets watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Get my friends now. 
face me doesn't negotiate with meanies. Well, there is something you could do. Facemeat was busy slamming mad raps at the gym and missed lunchtime, you see? So Facemeat's hungry. Do something about that, and Facemeat will think about getting your friends Oh, home. I'm gonna have to go talk to that other gal and go steal some bread. Oh, you know what I just remembered? I think I can get Nell to help me, because she said to ask her if I need anything. Yo, Jesse. It pro well, you know what? You it probably with... won't no, pop I mean, up seriously. until. I mean, uh... anything oh, no, we got a bunch of stuff. Like, I want to help out people. Well, actually, I'm trying to bribe that guard, face me. And he's hungry. Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees us. We're basically in a gulag, that's what I just realized. The foods are rationed, we're forced to do hard labor. We're basically just, yeah. Go ahead, that should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah, it'll grow back. Just uh, leave the seeds, yeah? Okay, leave the seeds. One, planting as I go. It's gonna make me manually do this. And that's another. <laughs> Sweet. And why am I planting them all soon. in three different? Nice. They're all in three different stages of growth. Looks what? Like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully, bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Wait, I saw a few wood planks by the dojo. Right on. Thank you, Nell. I gotta go yeah, over no to the problem. dojo and Happy build a crafting table Catch you now. Later, yeah? Great. Okay, so I guess that was a lot easier than I thought. For a minute there, I thought I was gonna have to go over and steal, like, an actual thing of bread from Clutch. The was it the gladiator over there guarding the bread? The one I didn't finish talking to. There, that should be enough for a table. Okay, how do I craft one now? Oh, by mashing the A button. Got it. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Get the wheat, and it's one, two, a three, and a bread. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. Alright, face me. I got your bread. Um, hello? Hey, face me. Got some bread for ya. Bread, huh? It's not cake, but face me is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. Please get my friends. <laughs> Face me appreciates the politeness. Hang on. Hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. Back with Palma, you picked Lucas, and so today in that stupid game, I worry. Oh, I feel, yeah, I well, feel like I keep on flip-flopping. Is... Thanks. Why is she taller than me? Is that you just know, the camera don't angle? make this awkward. It was just on my mind, and... I did what I had to do. Well, I appreciate it. I'm glad you're with me. No, she's like, I think they accidentally, I don't know. Whoa! For some reason, her player model is taller than mine. Jesse. Out of nowhere. Yeah, it's good to see you. It's taller than you Lucas's. Too, Lucas. And Ivor. Where's your clothes? Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up. My outfit breathes. It might be the armor and the anyway, helmet that makes it look how's like it been that. Going out here? You, uh, you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary. I'm working on that. It's tricky, though. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. 
Don't worry. We're just in this tournament where if we win, we get the Atlas and our ticket home. Oh, well, that's better than I thought. But if we lose, we'll be mining for quartz forever. Nope, that is not a thing I want. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just uh, stare at you while you mine. Lucas, I'm sorry, we can't just leave. We made a deal. We have two more games to compete in. Well, hopefully we can get that over with quick. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. Well, I didn't think he'd come back. Hey, now! I said he would help. That's why I we're here. I did not think that Harper's one would be the root option, damn it. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting. Why did he put an emphasis Dude. on real? I can feel change in the air. Great, as long as I get to go home. That is the point. But you have to win first. And my job is to make sure everybody, even Hadrian, plays by the rules. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what the next event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> Hopefully. I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! I'm also noticing that their mouths are like desyncing from their when they talk i don't know if that's a bug Hello, i'm pretty sure it is hopefully this reload here fixes it <laughs> it's gonna be a hot one Woo, yes it is adrian and how are our teams looking otto well mevia purple green and yellow are still making a strong showing but after yesterday's performance in sleep I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course, about our plucky newcomers. Otto, shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. <laughs> Wonder how this is going to go. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these pompous jerks. Yeah, I'm right there with you. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. I think Time it's her helmet. Yeah. I feel like her helmet starting is what's line, making her huh? look like she's taller Grace, than everyone. We've totally got this. Petra, <laughs> got it's... This, huh? I don't know. It's just Surprise a perspective thing. It could be that as well. How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian. And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ. What's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. We have appearances to keep up here. I'm just looking forward to a fair contest where the best person wins. Well, listen to this little pillar of nobility, huh? Don't you worry. That's what these yeah, games Yeah, he's not going to give us about. a fair competition just at all. Just ask Tim. I feel like Tim's fake. I feel like it. I admire your confidence, Jesse, but I must ask, what makes you think you can win when so many others have failed? Huh? Do you really think you're 
special. The thing about me and my team, Hadrian, no matter the challenge, we always find a way. Oh, really? Because it seems like two members of your team have already been eliminated. Yeah, and there's two left. More than enough to win this. Yes. Perhaps we should just get on with this. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but... Uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? You wishing me good luck? Come on, Em, that sounds pretty suspicious. Maybe we got off on the wrong foot earlier. I'm sorry. I was just mad about my old teammate you eliminated. Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and I thought... I feel like she cut her own my deal. enemy is my friend. M might be up to something. Yeah, no, she is. So, uh, yeah. I don't trust anybody How here. We work together on this. She uh, might be the trap Hadrian was talking about. And you could use my help. <laughs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. Oh, come on, M. You expect me to believe that? What are you up to here? Nothing, honest. It's just watching you negotiate with Hadrian, trying to get home. It inspired me. It made me want to go home, too. We should be working together. In the middle of the race is a part with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean... No, we we'll do. be fine. I'm gonna stick with my team. And Did you she also just say yours. she's a former gladiator? Fine. I'll do that. Why would we want the reject gladiator to See help us? Gladiator Junction. We don't need them. They'll just hold us back. Most likely. I'm ready for this. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's going to involve a lot of punching. Give them all you got, Petra. No mercy. Been waiting all day for you to say that. Jesse, it is a total bummer that we are not going to be able to, you know, work together. Sorry you're going to lose now. I still think you're awesome, though. Competitors, on your mark! Okay. Get set. I feel like this is going to be oh. one of those running... Yeah, it's been a while since we had one of these. Whoa, oh, okay. Dodge the lava. Why? I'm hitting Y. Okay. Um. Did it bug out? I think it bugged out. A. Okay. There we go. Maybe I'm not supposed to dodge the lava. Maybe I'm supposed to. Yep. I'm supposed to go through these or hit the buttons to dodge. What is this? A. Okay. A. What is this? Oh, go over here. Oh, we did it. This has been pretty tough. Can't wait to see what else they throw at us. Get ready to witness some greatness. Greatness, huh? Huh? Out of the way, chumps. All right. I think we got to eliminate yellow now. There we go. Uh, X. He's out. Slide. Nice. Okay. Who's next? Ugh. Not quite. Oh, thank you. I think they realized I eliminated like half their team. I don't know. How many yellow guys were there? It was like there was five then. There was like... Yeah. There was a lot of them, but I only thought I saw three back in the locker room. Okay. Sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? Oh, my body! Well, that answers that question. 
Oh, they're just letting him buy. Yeah, no, she definitely <laughs> cut her own deal. Any sense? Why aren't they? You're mine. I've been dreaming about this since sleep. Wow, your memory goes back that far. <laughs> Fire away. Bye, squishy. <laughs> Jesse, got your back. Go! Go! No! Oh no, they just eliminated Petra! Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. That's math. Let's go for you. Get rid of Slab. Just thinking the same thing about you. Duck. My sword! <laughs> Here comes the boom! <gasps> is face me helping me or is he just <laughs> Well it helped? Go. Yeah, it. Okay, maybe I can still win this thing. Oh, we're down Petra. I think we can still win this one Dude, though. I am like so close. I could do this. Sorry, Nell, I'm winning this thing. Oh, oh, I didn't realize it was going to be that one. I was getting ready to hit like A or something. Climb, Jesse, climb. Hey, whoa, whoa, Jesse. Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked whoa, whoa, on, slacker. On. Whoa, no. Uh, sorry now. I got to win. You, you'll respawn. Oh shit! I don't have a sword. Looking a little swordless there, Jesse. And I need a quick cussing so much. I'm sorry. Especially on games like this. The flint and steel. And there's nether rack. Oh, hit it! Boy, am I glad I've still got you. Soon we will have a winner, and I think I know who it will be. <laughs> I'm surprised that Jesse has not respawned yet. <laughs> Me too, Mevia. Me too. What? And in an unexpected twist and something that definitely was not planned... Jesse wins! Jesse wins! Jesse. And there appears to be a confrontation on the field. I'm glad I didn't make a deal with you. Good for you. You did whatever it took to win that race, Jesse. Good to know. And you. You were supposed to eliminate Jesse. Our deal's off. Deal? No, no, no. Please. You probably think I'm scum or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care. You have your I deal, knew it. If you win, she you had her own deal. Leave us anyway. My shot at going home just went up in smoke. So feel free to judge all you want. Hard to hurt me any more than Hadrian did just now. You really trusted Hadrian? That guy's like a creeper in a purple power suit. Hey, you try being stuck here as long as I have. Then you can talk. I'm out of here. Okay, respawning is the worst. You. Hadrian wants you. Hadrian? Why does he want to see me? You made him real mad. Come on. I don't have all day. 
I'm warning you, Jesse. Hadrian doesn't like to be kept waiting. Okay, if they want to see me, let's go. Uh, really? Well, that was unexpected. I guess he's not used to that. No, just Jesse. Ugh. Hadrian doesn't allow dirty respawns in the palace. Okay. Uh, sorry, Petra. Be safe, Jesse. I guess you gotta stay outside. Hmm. Hey, psst. I need to talk to you. Keep up. Come on. Come here. It'll be quick. Jesse, you gonna do what I say or not? Hey, Jesse. Yeah, over here. I'm coming. Good. I appreciate you being considerate. My job's on the line here, too, you know. I hope Hadrian's in a good mood. I hate being sent out on dumb errands. Hey, Slab, do you even like this job? You know... It's got its benefits. I get to beat up people, and most people are scared of me, which is cool. It's not bad, but the old builders aren't so great. I think maybe I should talk to the other guy. I went with Slab because I was hoping he would give me back Lucas's book. Did not look wow. like that was an so option, though. This is how the old builders live. Totally epic, right? Sometimes I just like to stand here and... This is incredible. Such amazing use of scale and angles. Right? Knew you'd be impressed. I get to hang out here whenever I want. And thanks to you actually helping us keep on schedule, we have some extra time to enjoy the place. I'll go get Hadrian. Oh, and don't touch anything. Got it. Touch everything. Slab said don't touch anything. He never said don't look at everything. Oh, and you know what? Because this is usually what I would go for as a place to pause. That's what we're going to do. This is going to be the end of the episode here. So if you guys have found yourself at any point today liking this episode, please do remember to leave a like and subscribe. Also, remember to ring that notification bell so that way you guys get notified upon me posting new videos. And as well, if you guys want to go above and beyond being a subscriber, I do have channel memberships. I am kind of working out uh, more about what they offer and all that. But as of now, it's like $1.99 and you get a special role in my Discord. That's about it. So, yeah, but if you guys are interested in that, I do offer those. But yeah, this has been Gunshy Mori signing off. Peace.